everybody so I kind of put that out there because a lot of new people to Mutt are asking me like bro does it make sense sometimes to complete the sets that you know what should you do here obviously this Von Miller is a pure unadulterated beast uh, the guy's an animal um, I had the other two versions of him uh, the conference hero and the ghost of Madden but um, you know I just decided look man we might as well go for the 99 that man destroyed Cam Newton's life in the Super Bowl and uh, he got a card that he rightfully deserved so I, I want to make sure I have the best Von Miller so Pretty much, the biggest thing is it just depends. You know how the market is. Guys are just straight up criminals. They just put out cards for like a trillion coins, whatever like that. But um, in this case, the most expensive card was that Keekly card. And like a couple days ago, he was at like 400K. 
like four, I mean, well, 400, yeah, 400K or something like that, I think, a little bit more. And uh, I saw him at 270, and I also saw the conference collectible about whatever, the 40-something K that I saw that when the video started. So I'm like, why not get him now? You know what I'm saying? Because his average price that he was going for was like 600 and like 50 or something like that earlier in the day. So I paid like 500 something for him. So, you know, you save 100K and you only do the sets if it makes sense. Um, I was looking through some of the comments on YouTube um, and I saw that a lot of guys are saying that EA should make it a lot easier to complete other sets for the people that grind out a lot of the solos and things like that and i agree but at the same time they allow people to make the market um so it's just like anything else you know people that make the market are always going to be criminals so it doesn't really matter you know what i'm saying bro you got to figure out sometimes they're going to be guys that don't understand what's going on and you're going to get a snipe every now and again you know yesterday on ps4 there was a 99 obj up for 148k or something like that or was it 168 something like that you know things like that happen where guys make mistakes whatever like that and you get a chance at a snipe. You gotta be at the right place at the right time. But this 99 Von Miller though, bro, I'm telling you this right now, he's going in with no loop though. Um, this is not really a lineup update. I'm actually putting something together for you guys that have been asking for it in my streams. Uh, once again, that's really appreciated uh, by the guys that come out and support the G Myers World streams and you know watch the videos and, and do those things. Those are you know really, really appreciated. Uh, but at the same time right here, just looking at his card, bro, this guy is a monster. Uh, we've added other things to the Jemiah's World Squad um, that you guys are going to be very, very... Uh, you guys might not want to miss the next stream. I'm going to tell you that right now. Uh, you might not want to miss um, the next video either because you're going to be seeing some Von Miller action. Bruh, straight up B-gap, dual B-gap up the anal action. Um, just be ready for it, bro. Because this card, this is probably... Like I said, man, this card is just really, really wild. I know they just released that Jason Taylor, but... It's Von Miller, dog, and Von Miller's here now. You know, that's a legend card, you know, back in the day, whatever like that. I'm always about living in the now, you know what I'm saying, bro? And this dude, Von Miller, right now, is the next up-and-coming premier pass rusher in the NFL. I'm so happy for him and his success coming off that ACL injury. Uh, so that's pretty much it right now. We got 99 Von. Stay tuned to the channel for more coming soon. One love.